Hurry! The underground base is past the communications tower. The elevator's working again, isn't it? I don't know why, but the elevator just started working again. If you take it all the way to the bottom of Tower B and go outside, you'll be in the snowfield. As long as the strategy of nuclear deterrence continues, nuclear weapons may be reduced, but they will never be eliminated. If you think about it, nuclear reduction does not mean much without elimination as the ultimate goal. I used to work in the DIA. I figured the only way to achieve nuclear elimination was to work from the inside to convince them of the ineffectiveness of the deterrence theory. Seems like you're pretty focused on that issue. Victims of nuclear radiation are a sad thing to see, and I have seen a lot of it. I have seen more than enough of it. I was born and raised in Pripyat, Ukraine. I was 10 years old on that day, April 26, 1986. You don't mean... Yes, Chernobyl. That is the day that changed my life and thousands of other lives. I live just three kilometers north of there. 600,000 to 700,000 people were evacuated. Over 650,000 children suffered the effects of radiation poisoning. Between 1986 and 1993, 12,000 children died. My parents and many others like them who helped in the cleanup died a few years later from radiation sickness. We must rid this world of all nuclear weapons before they cause more misery, before they destroy the delicate environment that keeps us alive. I will not allow this pain and anxiety to pass on to yet another generation. Snake, there's something I forgot to tell you before. What? There were five stealth camouflage prototypes in my lab. Yeah, so? If you take out the one I'm wearing, that leaves four. Hey, this isn't first grade math class. I thought I'd get one for you. So I went back to the lab and... Yeah? The four suits were missing. Also, about the elevator that I checked out, it's really strange. It was like someone was intentionally holding it. When you were riding on it, did the weight limit warning go off? That's another thing that bothered me about it. The warning went off, and I know I couldn't be over the limit. How much do you weigh? About 135. But that elevator had a weight limit of 650 pounds. It would take at least five people to go over that limit. Look 
out, Snake! The guys who stole my stealth prototypes are in there with you! Too late, Snake! Now die! I found a parachute near the wreckage of the Hind. A parachute? You don't think that Liquid survived? Impossible. As soon as he jumped out of the pilot's seat, he'd be sliced up faster than an onion on an infomercial. So what's that parachute doing there, then? I have no idea. A trap? Either that, or a message. To me. Meaning I'm not dead, I suppose. Maybe. But I think it's more like, I'll string you up. Well, in any case, don't let your guard down. I won't. It looks like the weather is getting worse. Try using your binoculars. What about the satellite data? I'm sorry, Snake. I can't see the entrance in the satellite photos either. What about a heat source? An exhaust pipe or something? I can't confirm anything. Only that there are multiple heat sources to the southeast of your position. That's probably just the burning wreckage from the hind. Snake, you're in a big open space surrounded by walls. The entrance to the underground base should be somewhere in there. Stay close to the walls and you won't get lost. Snake, you're our only hope. Please stop them from launching that nuke. Sound travels better in cold environments. If you're going to use a handgun, you should equip a suppressor. Otacon, which direction is the underground base? It's in the snowfield to the north of Tower B. The door is security level 6. The weather's terrible. Make sure you don't get lost out there. Snake, I don't have to tell you, but it's bitter cold out there. It'd be dangerous to stay out in the snowfield too long. If 
we do not drastically reduce the number of stockpiled nuclear weapons, it is going to become easier and easier for terrorists to get their hands on them. That means more terrorist attacks like this one. There was some talk about both sides reducing their nuclear stockpiles to a core deterrent force of less than 500 missiles each and declaring that there would be no nuclear counterstrike in the event of the use of conventional or chemical weapons, but talks fell through. It seems that America is unwilling to relinquish its position as the most powerful country in the world. Snake, are you okay? Otacon, were there any other stealth prototypes? No, there were only five. So, this isn't stealth camouflage then. What are you talking about? Someone's aiming at me, in the middle of this blizzard. It's her! Wolf? Sniper Wolf? Yes, it's her. It's definitely her. Otacon, you sound like you're happy. No, I'm not. So then what is it? Snake, please don't kill her. Are you insane? Please! She's a good person. You'd know that if you talked to her. Listen to me, kid. She's a merciless killer. I can see you perfectly from here. <laughs> I told you. I'd never quit the hunt. Now you're mine. Wolf, no, you can't. Don't get between a wolf and its prey. You're pretty good if you can hit me in this storm. You see, women naturally make better soldiers. Wolf, don't do this. Snake, I'm near. Can't you sense me near you? It's a mistake for a sniper to reveal our location. Is that right? Well, I'm going to send you a love letter, my dear. Do you know what that is? It's a bullet straight from my gun to your heart. Please, Wolf! Snake, no! Quiet! Don't get in our way! Now I'm gonna pay you back for Meryl. You men are so weak. You can never finish what you start. Sniper Wolf, you can only shoot at her with your PSG-1. Snake, Wolf is hiding somewhere in that snowfield. First you'll have to find out where she is. She should come out of hiding briefly to shoot at you. According to the SWAT manual, the longest a shooter can stay adequately focused on his target is 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, the observer and the shooter change places. Sniping is usually a two-man job. Otacon, where can I find ammo for the PSG-1? I... I can't tell you. unusual for a sniper to announce their presence before they shoot. She must have a real thing for you. Anyway, I do not think it is going to be as easy as before.
It looks like Wolf is down. Now get to Metal Gear's underground base on the double. So, you beat Wolf, huh? She was a fool to use the same tactics that failed her in your first meeting. But remember, don't let down your guard until you've got a confirmed kill. There is no doubt about it. After the Cold War ended, the chance of a full-scale, worldwide nuclear conflagration was diminished. But on the other hand, the chances of local tactical use of nuclear weapons greatly increased. Civil wars, revolutions, regional disputes. It seems like there is a new war popping up somewhere every day. And many of them are the result of centuries-old hatred between different ethnic or religious groups. These people do not think rationally or logically. In such conflicts, there is no concern for the high civilian casualty rate. An international criticism means little. A nuclear deterrent is meaningless because emotions run so hot. Furthermore, unlike strategic nuclear missiles, the decision to use tactical nuclear missiles is in some cases left up to battlefield commanders. It is pretty scary. As long as nuclear weapons continue to proliferate, the chances that someone is going to use them will also continue to grow. I... waited for this moment. I am a sniper. Waiting is my job. Never moving a muscle. Concentrating. <laughs> I am long shot. You cannot save me. Please. Just finish me quick. I am a guard. I have always dreamed of a peaceful place like this. A guard? So that's why you're called Wolf. I was born on a battlefield. Raised on a battlefield. Gunfire, sirens, and screams. They were my lullabies. Hunted like dogs, day after day. Driven from our ragged shelters. That was my life. Each morning I'd wake up and find a few more of my family or friends dead beside me. I'd stare at the morning sun and pray to make it through the day. The governments of the world turned a blind eye to our misery. But then, he appeared. My hero. Saladin. He took me away from all that. Saladin? You mean Big Boss? I became a sniper, hidden, watching everything through a rifle scope. Now I could see war, not from inside, but from the outside, as an observer. I watched the brutality, the stupidity of mankind through the scope of my rifle. I joined this group of revolutionaries to take my revenge on the world. But I have shamed myself and my people. I am no longer the wolf I was born to be. In the name of vengeance, 
I sold my body and my soul. Now I am nothing more than a dog. Wolves are noble animals. They're not like dogs. In Yupik, the word for wolf is Keglinek, and the Aleuts revere them as honorable cousins. They call mercenaries like us dogs of war. It's true. We're all for sale at some price or another. But you're different. Untamed. Solitary. You're no dog. You're a wolf. Who are you? Are you Saladin? Wolf. You spared Meryl's life. She... she was never my real target. I don't kill for sport. Rest easy. You'll die as the proud wolf you are. I finally understand. I wasn't waiting to kill people. I was waiting for someone to kill me. A man like you. You're a hero. Please. Set me free. Why? Why? I loved you. What is it? My gun. Give it to me. She's part of me. Everyone's here now. Oh, okay, hero. Set me free. Goodbye. Snake, you said that love could bloom on the battlefield. But I couldn't save her. What are you doing? Returning it to its owner. I don't need a handkerchief. Why? I don't have any more tears to shed. <gasps> I'm going to the underground base. We're out of time. I know. You'll have to protect yourself now. Don't trust anyone. Yeah. If I can't stop Metal Gear, this whole place will probably be bombed to hell. Yeah. We might not meet again. I'll hang on to my codec. I want to keep helping. You can leave any time. Get a head start. A head start on your new life. Snake! What was she fighting for? What am I fighting for? What are you fighting for? If we make it through this, I'll tell you. Okay. I'll be searching too.